Santa just brought me an extra early present, which is I just got pulled over for speeding. Um, he says, how's your record? Which is like, yes. I have had my license for 20 and a half years now. I have never gotten a ticket. I have been pulled over probably Shameless. five, six times. Shameless. Totally unfair. <laughs> he says the streak continues and and uh, Karen laid it on a little thick, saying that we were going to go get a puppy for Christmas, which is true. Which is true. But I think that might have been icing on the cake. to get a puppy this year. We're getting a puppy. <laughs> and the kids don't know. Karen just got finished dropping them off at Grandma's house, yep. at Grandma and Grandpa's house today. Tomorrow, they'll yep. shift over to Nana and Papa's house. They're getting to watch movies, make Christmas cookies, just have a fun time with grandparents. That gives us two full days to be able to hide this puppy from the kids. And then they'll come home late Christmas Eve after we are with family. Yep. And that sets us all up for a Christmas morning miracle surprise. So It's gonna be awesome. I started talking about the puppy thing for my birthday. Because I'm getting a puppy! <laughs> Randy has continued on saying that he's not having it. And I also even Happen. went to great lengths to tell them that Santa cannot bring puppies. Mommy convinced me. Yes. We called Santa and said, can we do this as part of, you know, gifts for the kids? Because Santa's amazing. The dog, it is a livestock guardian dog. Yes. It is one eighth Newfoundland and seven eighths Great Pyrenees. Yes. It's a female, no yes. name yet. No. We, we uh, have, have. We're gonna let the kids kind of be a part of the naming let them process. Vote. It's gonna be our new guard dog, livestock guardian dog yep. thing for the farm. We were really excited uh, to watch the Great American Farm Tour with Justin Rhodes. We got to see a ton of farms that had great Pyrenees. Yeah. I bought Karen a book for her birthday. All um, he said was I had to read the book. Yes. I've never read a book so fast in my life. Did you finish it? I'm a skimmer. I like to... <laughs> it's just kind of how I my approach. So we actually have a kennel. Thanks, neighbor Doug, for giving us a kennel last year. It's true. Uh, we have nothing else. We have no dog dishes, no food. Hey, there's another share. I'm, I'm going to speed limit this time. If you got pulled over again today, I would demand that they give you a ticket. <laughs> Next up, meeting the puppy for the second time, picking it up and bringing it home. We are here. Just standing on top of a mail. Hey mom, hey dad. You have arrived. Oh, I see someone holding the puppy. Okay. <laughs> Look at her. I'm still 
out okay done with our bath it's okay you're so little when you're all wet <laughs> and so big once you're all fluffed up yeah that was a little traumatic leaving your family all right go <laughs> Hi, fluffy puppy. So the puppy can't spend too much time in the house because she starts getting too hot. So we put her on the deck. Oh, there she is. She is so happy outside. It's like, you think like, oh, little puppy, like it's gonna be too cold, you know? Even though they're like meant, they're really good for cold weather, you kind of think like, when they're little, it's gonna be too cold or whatever. It's like 19 degrees outside today, and she is like, yes! Okay, puppy. Are you ready to go meet your animal friends? Here we go. Come on, puppy. Let's go. Good girl. Totally just follows us. So awesome. Are you sitting? Come here. Oh, she she hears the chickens. <laughs> hey, cat. Who is that? Is there a new friend here? Okay. Day two of puppy ownership. We're learning more of the doggie's patterns. She basically goes to over to Karen to see what's up and then she sits on her blanket and plops down, just like so. So it's Christmas Eve. Tonight you'll spend a little time out by the sheep in your kennel outside and then tomorrow morning the big reveal. What are we doing? Petting the puppy. <laughs> We're imprinting. We have to pet and love the puppy because it's part of its training. We're gonna have to set up a little warming area, maybe with a heat lamp and um, whatever, because she does not want to sleep in the house. And she also seemed to be most comfortable when she was taking a nap inside, sleeping on an ice pack. She laid and right on top And she laid of on it. top of it and went to sleep. Went to sleep. If that isn't the weirdest thing I've ever heard. <laughs> but then we also kind of realized that this dog was born, what, October 19th? And has been sleeping outside in single digits for at least the past week. Yep. So being in the 68 degree house is it's like a vacation to Florida. That she never wanted. That she never wanted. <laughs> she wants to go back outside and be in the cold. Best Christmas ever. Mom, I got a great pair of these puppies for my doll. You did? Yeah! Oh, God! True books! No, 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 no. You guys seem kind of excited. Yeah! Star Wars Mart Watch. Dad, look, this is all the stuff you can do. Everything! Santa put Dad, my horses in there! Jack, let's Can see I it. Can I play with it yet? Yeah, wait, it says, oh, Mom, I, I said I invited you. Oh, this is leash. awesome. Okay. She got a leash. Elsa, is that your puppy? It's, it's a great Pyrenees puppy. You got a great Pyrenees puppy? This is the best Christmas ever. But it'd be and look at all the presents we still have yet to open. I know. And this is, it would be an even better if we got it. Okay, let's see. If, if we got it. Do you see a puppy? No. We already we have one. Like... Out in the barn.
like it's like the North Pole blew up in our in our living Actually, room. Actually, it's more like the scene from the Christmas story after they've all unwrapped presents. It's Christmas morning. It's minus one degrees out. Just finished opening presents. Merry Christmas, chickens. <laughs> yep, Merry Christmas to you too. Merry Christmas. What do we have here? <gasps> A puppy. Oh my goodness, Santa. What did you do? Come on. Come over here. Oh my goodness. Hi. Hi. Yes. Good morning. Good morning. Hi. Merry Christmas, puppy. Are you ready? Say cheese, puppy. Say cheese. cheese. There it is. What a perfect picture. Cheese. Yay. Oh, that's Christmas card. Yeah. Okay, what's happening here? We are having puppy love time. Is it puppy time? Is it? Is it oh, a? Did you have a good Christmas, puppy? Willa? Willa. Her name is Willa. Well, I've gotten used to calling her puppy because we waited before we gave her a name. So your name is Willa, which means protector. Are you going to protect our sheep? Yes. Are you going to protect our chickens? Right now she's just a fluffy ball. No, you're just a cute dog to protect a cute sheep. All right. Let's finish it up. Hey, Willa. Merry Christmas. Hey. Willa. <laughs> Just back to her house. Merry Christmas, Willa. Say Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Can you say Merry Christmas? How about one more kiss? One more kiss. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Merry Christmas. There it is. Yeah. Merry Christmas, Willa. <laughs>